Thank you. It's wonderful to be reunited with my television family. <laughs> well, some of them anyway. I only invited three of them because the rest are hated. <laughs> Especially the Lisa Bow Knight. That crazy, drug-addled, ghost-faced, Rastafarian, Lenny Kravitz-loving hippie bitch! <laughs> but here's the ones that I love. First up is my boy, Theo, Malcolm Jamal, Theo. <laughs> the show it's so raven please give it up for simone olivia <laughs> and last but not least my beautiful tv wife felicia richard claire huxtable <laughs> Welcome back, Huxtables. Oh, thank you so much, Bill. <laughs> oh, look, there she is, my cute little baby, Olivia. And she's even got her own private cable access show. <laughs> uh, actually, Mr. Cosby, it's the Disney Channel. Well, <laughs> you just keep plugging away at it, sweetheart. You'll be back in show business before you know it. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Cosby, I'm doing great. Uh, actually, I'm considered the black Hillary Duff. I've got my own sitcom, a big picture deal at Disney. I'm about to drop a new CD. Uh... And cut! Stop talking. Your voice is irritating. <laughs> you know, I realize that at this point in the show, a lot of you may have questions that you'd like to ask me about the Cosby Show. So without further ado, let's turn up the lights and ask away. Have you guys ever occurred, uh, have had any difficult instances on or off? Either filming? you're going to wear your glasses or you're not. What are you going to do? <laughs> there you go, How's young that? man. See, this is the is problem better with for you? you today. <laughs> ask away. All right. Any, any difficult <laughs> any difficult circumstances, anything happened on or off the show that made it uncomfortable for you guys? Well, there was the time that uh, my wife Camille was this found out that I actually was kissing Lisa Bonet behind the dressing room. <laughs> you know, infidelity is not something to be proud of, but hey, when you want to put your pudding pop in the pudding, you know. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I, I was wondering if there were any drugs involved in the Cosby show. Oh, goodness. He's just opened Pandora's box. <laughs> well, if laughter and love and family morale is a drug, we were all high. <laughs> there were a couple other instances with um, marijuana and also the heroin that we spoke of before. Mm. Um, and uh, I, I had to, to, to taste a couple of times, but that's why I speak the way I do today. In the whitey words of my man Dave Chappelle, Coke is a beautiful thing. I didn't know you liked Dave Chappelle, Mr. Cosby. I don't even know who Dave Chappelle is. <laughs> oh, goodness, a black person. Did you guys ever fix soul food on the show? No, everything we did was white. That's why we stayed on for 42 years. <laughs> oh, another black person. This one looks interesting. Oh, uh, um, what are y'all doing today? See, eating enough. That is exactly what I'm talking about. That is the problem with today's black youth. You're sitting around and you're stealing and you're drinking liquor and you're smoking the crack, man. <laughs> put down the pipe long enough, you'd realize that the Raven show ain't even funny. <laughs> Not to mention the fact you can't even string two sentences together and make a complete phrase. Stop sniffing glue and go see Fat Albert. This show is over. 